Hello people and welcome to this tutorial on how to update your Garmin device on a Mac. We can see here that we have updates available and got my new maps lifetime Europe. I will back up the device before update and I have read and agreed to the terms and conditions. If this is still greyed out and you've connected your uh, your device after you started Garmin Express, then just go down here and press uh, refresh and it should pop up. So what we're going to do now is just press install. The backup already completed, it's pretty quick, and um, preparing to install the maps. This could take some time, so we'll just fast forward. Now, now it's asking if I want to use a micro SD card or I want to select a region. So, and there is not enough space to install the updates on the actual device. So, what we'll do, we can do two ways. We could either go to your micro SD and install everything on there. Or what you can do is select a region, let's say for example, select a region continue, and then choose, let's see, uh, in my case, it's going to be Western Europe, and install just on your Mac. So you could go ahead and click install here. And I can show you later on how you would get over this because if you do this, then of course it won't be on your on your actual device. What you'll do is you'll try to upload the, the routes and it will tell you that the map is not the same version as the one that you're uploading. So what we're gonna do is go back and go to mini SD card and press install. This will install it just on your garden. Right, and that was it. 1 hour 16 minutes and 44 seconds after I started, the um, device was up to date. So, let's see what we've got here. Go into maps, and we've still got that map here. Go into my Garmin. I'm just going to restart base camp just in case. And it should find my, there you go, reading maps. So now we've got a 3D map. Let me switch over to that. So now we've got the 2013.4. So what we'll do is we'll just do a 
test and we'll unplug go to maps we'll unplug the Garmin object I'm going to unplug it and we go to the maps and you see that your 2013.4 has gone together with the uh, 3D maps. So basically you have to, if you install your maps on your SD cards then you will have to um, plan your trip whilst the Garmin is connected which is not the best idea. So what we're going to do now is we're going to connect our Garmin up again. There you go, now it's connecting up. Reinstall maps. So whilst that's... Now, there's not enough uh, space to be installing the updates. And we've tried the micro SD card which basically means that you have to select you can only uh, plan the trip whilst the unit is connected so now we're going to go to selective region and we're going to go to Western Europe and I'm going to select both the device and the Mac which means that it will put it on but this is not going to let me because there's not enough space on the actual unit which means silly enough that we have to install it just on the Mac so let's do that previously you would get to choose to install it on the unit and the Mac and it would let you choose the SD card which they've kind of dropped and this is Garmin Express 2.12 so please Garmin do something about this is uh, this is what's is known as double work Right. What device is up to date? Let's have a look. I've got 2013.4. Very checked. And I still haven't got. But let's try to switch base camp off. Start up again. Right. So basically, base camp just needed to restart. So that was a tutorial on how to install correctly and I've used what I've used a total of uh, one minute and one hour and thirty seven minutes. So that was that. I hope uh, this tutorial was useful
and showed you how to install um, everything properly. So, until then, next time, ride safe.